Hello guys, Shekhar here. Today I am going to show you how to connect GNS3 router with the internet. In this tutorial, I am going to use a virtual Microtech router. If you guys wanted to know how to install a virtual Microtech router in GNS3, the link is available in the description. You can go through it. Let's begin. Here I need then cloud to connect my router with the virtual adapter. I need one switch and I need one microtech router. That's all. Now I'm going to configure the cloud for my loopback adapter. If I click on drop down list I can see my loopback adapter here. If you guys want to know how to install a loopback adapter, you can click on the link on the screen. Link is also available in the description. You can click on the add here. You can apply it. Click on OK. I need link tool. From here, I'm going to connect into the switch, and from the switch, from the switch to my micro deck ethernet one micro deck is booting now by default the username is admin the password is blank i'm in the micro deck now now what I'm going to do is I'm going to assign an IP on the Ethernet one of this microtech via loopback adapter. To do that, I'm going to use an DSCP client to get an automatic IP address from my loopback adapter itself. So all I have to do is IP DSCP client interface client add interface ether1 disable no now i have to check what ip address i got from the loopback adapter as you can see i'm getting a dscp address from the adapter that is 192.168.137.238 now to test that if i'm actually connecting on the internet or not so i can do a ping to 8.8.8.8 .8 that's global dns and as you can see i'm getting a replies i can also do a ping on google.com cross verify as you can see i'm getting a reply from the google.com as well so it's actually connected with the internet